Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. In a strategic move with profound implications for the ongoing conflict, the United States has discreetly delivered long-range Atkins missiles to Ukraine, a first in the two-year-long struggle. This development, confirmed by senior U.S. officials including Jake Sullivan, advisor to President Biden, marks a significant shift in the balance of power in the region. According to reports from Politico dated April 24, 2024, the transfer of Army Tactical Missile Systems, ATACMS, occurred last month, following the approval of a new $1 billion military aid package by President Biden. This package, aimed at bolstering Ukraine's defense capabilities, includes an array of advanced weaponry such as Stinger anti-aircraft missiles, 155mm artillery shells, Bradley fighting vehicles, Javelin anti-tank systems, and Claymore anti-personnel munitions. The decision to include Atkins missiles in the aid package was not taken lightly, with initial hesitation from U.S. authorities due to concerns over stockpile management and fears of escalating the conflict. However, escalating Russian aggression and increased production of the long-range variant of Atkins ultimately convinced President Biden to authorize the transfer. The impact of these missiles was swiftly felt as Ukrainian forces utilized them in two separate strikes. The first attack, on April 16, 2024, targeted an airbase in Jankoy, Crimea, resulting in the destruction of four Russian S-400 air defense systems and three radar stations. A subsequent strike, on April 23, 2024, reportedly hit a radar installation near Mariupol. The Atkins, renowned for its high precision and speed, is propelled at approximately Mach 3 and can strike targets between 160 and 300 kilometers away. Equipped with advanced guidance systems combining GPS and inertial navigation, these missiles pose a formidable threat to enemy installations. The decision to provide Atkins missiles to Ukraine was backed unanimously by senior U.S. officials, including National Security Advisor Jake Sullivan, Secretary of State Antony Blinken, Secretary of Defense Lloyd Austin, and Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff General C.Q. Brown. Their recommendation reflects a concerted effort to empower Ukraine and compel Russia to reassess its strategic calculus. By enabling Ukraine to strike deep into Russian-held territory, the Biden administration aims to disrupt critical command and control nodes and other high-value targets, thereby altering the dynamics of the conflict in Ukraine's favor. This move underscores the United States' commitment to supporting its allies and defending the principles of sovereignty and territorial integrity. As the situation in Ukraine continues to evolve, the delivery of Atkins missiles heralds a new phase in the conflict, one where Ukraine stands poised to assert its strength and resilience against aggression. The strategic implications of this decision are profound, shaping the trajectory of the conflict and signaling America's unwavering support for its allies in the face of adversity. That's all for now, see you later.